and then known for cheap pieces of meat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't eat beyond cheap pieces of meat. <laughs> cheap pieces means I love Jesus and Jesus loves me. Amen. You know, the Bible says we should always rejoice in the Lord. Yeah. Why we are rejoicing in the Lord, you know, in every area of development is going on, spiritual development is going on, and social life also, mental also, religiously also, even, uh, you know, in all the areas. So when we say development, you know, in the first place, in the eyes of God, what do what is right and good in the sight, in the eyes of God, what the Bible is, not in the eyes of the devil, <laughs> Not in the eyes of the politician, not in the eyes of, you know, your friend or your, maybe, your colleagues. Do what is right and good in the sight of the Lord. And by the grace of God, through your prayers, you no know, KBC, you know, development is going on. And now the new building also coming out. And this is the old building. In those days, the best building, okay. <laughs> and said those 70, those were the days. You guys are in the palace. <laughs> But today, more than palace, okay, it will be the history of the building now. The first Bible college in Danone. And the first Bible college, charismatic Bible college in Northeast India. So I always encourage the student, don't complain. When you see the shilling, you should surprise. During the time of Jesus, there was no shilling. <laughs> <laughs> so don't complain about rest too, because during the time there was no restroom okay in our time also restroom means you no know, in our time we are very hygienic okay restroom means you have to go to jungle and say <laughs> you know over here we call it toilet so one and ten no development also going on and i want to, i want to share something or development as you see the you no know, voice was there is standing up and then, you know, like the girls of Stelzo in the past already done. Um, why this thing happened? Because of your prayer. Because prayer play, play a vital role in the last days. You'll find in Luke chapter 21, verse 26. Watch and pray. And then 1 Peter chapter 4, verse 7. You should be very serious in the last days. Prayer. Watch and pray. Why? Because prayer play a what role? And because of your prayer. And you guys, you know, friends, and will we serve up? And you know, the family of Kwema Babu College, you know, you are praying. And because of your prayer, you know, many things are happening now. You know, the Bible school also went through rough time. Why may I say rough time? You no, know, in the financial area also. But by the grace of God, you know, God bless in, in so many ways. Why? Because of prayer. No, our friends, or maybe your friend, or maybe our political, somebody not promoted to him. Even our late principal also, and some of the staff also, and you know, like some of the alumni also. By now, they will be having a fellowship with us. Because of that, see, blessings. A new building was all coming up. And over here also, we always pray for you. So Paul says in, Corinthians, in Colossians chapter 2, verse 5. I'll read Colossians chapter 2, verse 5, and then you know, and then I will present some of the, some of the you know, some of the next one. I don't need the, the, the future, okay? which we are going to observe next year. Colossians chapter 2, verse 5. Man of God, you know, he wrote a letter to Colossian church. You no, know, the Colossian church were, you know, carried away by their philosophies. Therefore, man of God says, you know, philosophy or whatever should not mislead you, distract your mind. But you should be always on the word of God. Colossians chapter 2, verse 5. For though I am absent in flesh, yet I am with you in spirit, rejoicing to see your good orders and the steadfastness of your faith in Christ. And you guys, you are very busy, and yet you have made yourself available, you have made yourself available here in this meeting now. 
It's an it's a encouragement to us also. And because of your prayer, see, things are going, you know, beyond our comprehension. When I say beyond, it's a miracle. So prayers, your prayer are, you know, answering, and you can see things are going on. And still, you know, we have to pray for one another. Over here also, we always pray for you. Right, Parma Bhakta is known for dawn prayers, known for Friday night. See, chain prayer. Then known for Fatima prayer. Known for what? Anointing ministry. So many, many Bible colleagues talk about you no know, head knowledge. But Parma Bhakta is known with emphasis anointing. The Bible says, so because of anointing, you can declare the year of the Lord. What do you see? In Luke chapter 4, verse 18. And 19. So, when about college, we always emphasize on anointing also. And to compare with, you know, Bible college, the rest of Bible college in Nagole, or maybe, you know, maybe you know, not this India, you no know, people see. This college as what? For the sin, no church planters. For the sin, you know the pastors. Even in Kohima also, many of our graduates you know they are church planters. Example, even our pastor is here having nurses on on church also, he's a brother, then some other guys also. So to start a church is not easy. But in Kohim, in Denmark also, see, people, you know, started their own church. Even Pastor Jacob also here. See, as I say, Pastor Kinney also. And then, like in secretary, to to you know, to Baptist, such as all our, our former bridges. Also, okay, they need you also. And then, you know, as I said, they know light in New Market also. So, the pastor also. Pastor Vidi also here. So, Dimar also. See, many talk about theologies. So many theologies. But to be in the fields. To face the realities, you know, to present himself or herself or what, like David. You know, people be, you know, shut the mouth. So we are really proud of you. And today, your the way you share, you know, it's really encouraging, it's really boost. Your present is a blessing to us, and we also always pray for you, seeing your face also. You guys are presenting yourself as well, Mr. Universe. <laughs> and Mrs. and Miss Universe, like my wife, okay? <laughs> I always address my wife as Mrs. Universe. Very beautiful. When I see her, you know, even the dogs will turn to, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys also? So development, you guys are developing, okay, your ministry. That is a real development. And then, you know, as we are having this fellowship together, you know, futures, when I say futures, next years, you want to observe golden Judy. So, you know, you want to put in your, in your mind also, so that you pray for them. Of course, supposed to, we have to, supposed to observe in 2020, but because of pandemic also, you could not observe. But we are praying that in the next year we will not observe. And we have already sent the information to our alumni. Some of them are doing very well in America also. Some are doing ministry in Germany, Denmark, and then, you know, Africa, like Myanmar, Thailand, China, and Australia, doing very well, urban aliens and also. And then some of them doing ministry like in Bhutan, Nepal, India. So sending the information. And the next year we are going to observe, you know, Jubilee. 
So Jubilee is very, very important in the Old Testament, you know, once in the year, once in 50 years, therefore Jesus. A year of reconciliation, a year of, you know, restoration, a year of forgiveness, a year of prosperity. So just to present it, you know, in your mind, so that you guys can pray for the, for the future program also, the project. You know, when I say project, you know, you know the project, spiritual project, name is Judith. So I pray for them also. And then, you know, as ministry is going on, and we need your prayer also, and you are part of this Koyama Bible College, and we always count on you. And then, you know, wherever you receive the blessing, you know, wherever you receive the blessing, where, from which place, you know, you have learned worship. Very, very important. Many times, you know, we forget by, you know, the psalmist, the best king, David. You know, you'll find in Hebrews chapter 11, among top six things. You know, Old Testament, top six things. You know, God has chosen. And others, other top six things of it. Only one, one king name is mentioned. That was David. Why David? There are so many qualities you'll find, but you know, God has given the revelation to Samuel. He is a man who is after my own heart. You'll find in, you know, Samuel. 